Hello and welcome to this quick video. I am super excited. Those of you that know me know I'm a little bit of a sucker for geek toys and anything technology related. So I have a new toy and I want to share the moment of first unboxing it, first getting it set up with you because some of you watching this may be interested in that new toy. It's the Amazon Echo. So today, to help me, I just have here with me my daughter Isabella, just her. She's gonna be off to the side here, hanging out with daddy. So let's get to it. Um, you've seen all, there's all kinds of unboxing videos out there. You don't need to see what everything looks like. I'm just gonna tell you my opinion. I was struck by the simplicity of the packaging. You get a black box with no logos whatsoever on it. It's just a black box. And you slide the sleeve off. It's orange, very cool. And then you open it up and that's orange. And you're just given this little, I mean, this thing just fits right in there. You take it out, you get, well, you get a little remote in there, you get batteries, which is nice, but it's a very sleek looking packaging. It's just, it's just cool. It just feels cool. It feels like, it feels like I'm opening up the future or something. You get it out and you look at it and it's, it feels like a pretty premium product. I mean, not out of this world premium, but it feels like it's got a good feel to it. It, it, it looks good. It's a good size. Um, and it just feels like a good product. Kind of like an Apple TV. You know that black look where it's simple but it still feels classy? Kind of that feel to it. So, impressed so far. You light it, you get it going, and you get this blue ring around it. I've already installed the companion app, but I've done nothing else. I haven't set it up. I haven't entered any information. I don't have it hooked into my Wi Fi yet. Nothing. So you get this glowing blue ring, which is kind of cool, when you first plug it in. Here's my initial thoughts, having done nothing to it so far. Um, I had to get on an invite list, it took a couple weeks, and then it was right after Christmas that I could actually purchase it. Um, I'm a Prime subscriber, and I think... Oh, we have a new color. So we've changed to orange Hello. now. Oh. Your Amazon device is ready for setup. Just follow the instructions in your companion app. That was kind of cool. Hello. Ready for setup. Baby's excited about it. So here's my first thoughts. I'm a Prime subscriber. I, I use Prime for videos instead of Netflix. I don't use Netflix at all at this point. Um, I use Prime for videos and content. I shop on Amazon a lot. Um, I love the two-day shipping, which is why I initially bought Prime. And I feel like the Prime price of $99 for this is good. I don't know that I would pay $200 for this so far. Um, it's a toy, it's useful, it seems like a good, good gadget to have around the house. Even just as a Bluetooth speaker, I feel like $99 is a fair price. You can't unplug it, there's no battery, it's, you've got to be plugged in at all times. But I think that $99 is fair. I wouldn't spend $200 if I wasn't a, a Prime subscriber. Um, but I think the price, $99 is fair. So that's my thoughts. I don't think um, this is going to be a huge technology game changer or anything it's a fun it's a, it's a fun gadget and I'm interested to, to use it all right so the app is already downloaded it's prompting me to log in get started with these easy steps connect the echo to Wi-Fi put batteries in your echo remote and learn how to use the echo begin echo setup wait for the orange light ring which I have I have the orange light ring I got it connect your iPhone go to your Wi-Fi settings and select the Amazon network Got a nice little You've feedback connected there. to your device. Go ahead and complete the setup in your companion app. Okay, so setup complete. Still get the glowing orange ring. I'm given a short video to walk through to get started. Alexa, how many different programming languages are there? Sorry, I don't have the answer to that question. Okay. But I've added a Bing search to the Echo app. Interesting. Alexa, how much does the average four-month-old baby weigh? Sorry, I can't find the answer to the question I heard. Alexa, what's the average age of a four-month-old baby human? Sorry, I can't find the answer to the question I heard. 
Well, this is not going well so far. Play some Jesus culture music. Shuffling Jesus culture from Prime Music. That's cool. That's cool. Alexa, lower the volume by 50%. That's pretty cool. It's got a good sound. The bass tones are really well. It's not a Bose speaker, but the bass sounds good. Um, right now I'm at a comfortable, I would play this in the background at my house during dinner at this level, and it sounds really good. Alexa, pause the music. It's pretty responsive too. How many books are in the Library of Congress? Hmm, I don't know. But you can take a look at the Bing search link I added in the Echo app. All right, so I'm getting quite... It takes me to the music I was playing in the app and it shows me where I was paused. So that's pretty cool, that's a nice feature. Um, like I said, even as just a Bluetooth speaker, if I just was pairing my phone to this and didn't have any of the technology capabilities, it sounds good. If you want just a home speaker for your kitchen or something, it's a good sound. Alexa, what's the weather in Easton, Pennsylvania tonight? Currently, in Eastern Pennsylvania, it's 27 degrees with cloudy skies. Tonight, 27 degrees? You can look degrees. for cloudy skies moving in and out, and a low of 15 degrees. So that's pretty cool. Um, what else should we do with this thing? Alexa, add diapers to my shopping list. I added diapers to your shopping list. The shopping list takes place within the app the companion app. Pretty cool. Oh, conveniently, you can search Amazon for diapers. Huh. Alexa, is Amazon going to use you to take over the world and infiltrate people's privacy? She didn't like that one. No response. Is Jeff Bezos a greedy pig who's invading everyone's privacy and ruining their lives? Sorry, I didn't understand the question I heard. Huh. Alexa, how many different species of dogs are there? Sorry, I can't find the answer to the question I heard. I'm not gonna lie, pretty disappointing so far. Although my expectations were somewhat low because, like I said, even if there was no technology aspect to this, I would be okay with it as a speaker. But even so, I don't feel like I'm asking that many complicated questions. Alexa, what's the population of Fort Worth, Texas? The population of Fort Worth, Texas is about 741,000. Wow, that's nice. Alexa, how far away is the nearest Home Depot? I wasn't able to understand the question I heard. Alexa, how far away is the nearest Home Depot? Hmm, I can't find the answer to the question I heard. Okay, All right, so what I'm going to do now, I'm interested in the, how this far field technology works. So I'm going to go to the other side of the room, probably, well, I don't know, 50, 60 feet away, and see if I can do it without yelling. Alexa, how tall is Mount Everest? Mount Everest's height above sea level is 29,029 feet, 8,848 meters. Alexa, how much does a coconut weigh? Sorry, I don't have the answer to that question. I was pretty far away. I was the other side of my living area here, so that was pretty far. I feel like if I was talking to somebody, that was the farthest I would be talking without yelling at them. So. That, that's pretty impressive. I like that. I can set, set it pretty much anywhere in the room and it's going to work. So, so far, my initial impression before using it, and we'll see how this changes on a daily basis, but my impression that I gave you before using it still stands. It's, it's a cool gadget. It's a great, it sounds great. It's a great sounding speaker. Um, I use Prime so I can access my Prime music. Yeah, see? It's great. I can access my Prime music. Um, Alexa, play Thunderstruck by ACDC. 
Thunderstruck by ACDC tribute from Prime Music. Alexa, raise the volume to 80%. So this is a tribute. I don't know if she's at 80% of her capacity or if it was by 80%. Alexa, pause the music. So my initial impression still stands. It's a cool gadget. It's a fun toy. I don't know how it'll work on a daily basis, how it'll affect my life. But overall, I'm impressed. For 99 bucks, it's a solid piece of technology. Is it world changing or groundbreaking? I don't know. Um, not really, but it's cool. So that's, that's my initial thought there. What do you think? Do you think that um, this is a complete invasion of pri privacy, that Amazon is listening to my every word, and that I'm being spied on by the government, or that it's just a cool piece of technology? Um, I'd love to hear your thoughts. I'm, I'm impressed, I'm not blown away, um, but I, I feel like I got what I expected. And so, um, it's, like, it's, it's, a, it's, a good, it's a good gadget, I would recommend it, 99 bucks.